मैं तो इस काबिल ही नहीं हूँ कि मैं काबिल के बारे में कुछ भी बोलूँ बिकॉज काबिल इज नॉट अ पिक्चर इट्स अ पिता का अपने पुत्र के लिए प्यार Actually, we are at fault. Somehow, if we had managed to make Mohin Jandaro a hit, probably the Russian Khandan wouldn't have tried so hard. But Dan Rakesh Roshan is at it again. This time as a producer, trying to make a PPT presentation which tells us what a nona Kabil putter he is. Ritik dance कर सकता है, fight कर सकता है, acting कर सकता है, रो सकता है, हंस सकता है. We see that for one thirty-eight minutes. Ritik plays a blind guy who falls in love with a blind girl on a blind date and then spends the rest of his time trying to fight a blind to justice system. I'm not being mean to blind people. I'm just saying the plot puns get to you after a while. Ritik and Sharuk don't just share the release dates of their film. There's one more thing in common. Both these movies have a 70s ka hangover. Rape, revenge, kanoon ke lambe haath, gande politicians. These are things we have seen. Yeah, but Ritik is taking revenge. Director Sanjay Gupta does manage to choreograph the fight sequences very nicely. They are dark and disturbing and all that. But the way the songs have been inserted, they kind of take away from the sincerity that a film like this should ideally have. Ritik is good. No surprises there. How the film ends? No surprises there too. Or tabi? No surprises. I'm going to give Kabil an average 2.5 quints out of five. Kar pe aayi na TV pe? Tab dekhte.